What the f***? Dude, I have a towel! <laughs> what the f***? We're just chasing him with Lamborghini parts. You know it's gonna be a good unboxing when you look at the box and the color says raw. <laughs> I like that. That means it's gonna be a custom finish. I know what the color is, but I have not seen it in person before and not on this wheel either. So it's gonna be a first time for both of us. Oh, that is cool. Wow, that shit looks really good. Someone was daring enough to to pick a cool color. This finish is just bonkers, man. So this is the Boston HF5 wheel, 20 by 12. This is a real wheel for a GTR. There's two finishes that this wheel comes in, matte graphite, and it comes in gloss black. But if you're willing to pay a little bit extra and get your wheels custom made, then you're open to nine different finishes. But if you notice, even in that list of nine custom colors, purple is not one of them. Heywood, how did you get this wheel Purple. What do you know that we don't know? It's very simple. EVS is the best dealer in the world. Chances. In the world. This is a special one of a kind. No one else has this out there. When the light hits it, you get, of course, the lighter portions, and then the darker portions look really menacing. If you want to have custom, custom, custom hybrid forged wheels, hit us up. Our contact info is in the description down below. And since we're shipping these out to a client who lives somewhere far, far away, we can do the same for you too. Slaps the top of a wheel. This right here, that meme where they're like the guy slaps the roof of a car. This bad boy now has so much damage to it. This bad boy can fit so much spaghetti. In. Mamma mia! This right here, we have a special on for one dollar a wheel, and with tires included. Wait, hold on. I want that deal. Give me this. We have Aston Martin today. We're putting on some new wheels for this thing. So this is a special edition. This is a carbon edition. Probably just means that it's carbon fiber, which is right there. So we got some HRE's monoblock one piece wheels. This looks like a gloss gunmetal finish. Why are you wearing a face mask? How much you heard? It has landed in Houston. Do you like my mask? Yes, Houston first you heard it. Don't take it off now. <laughs> Huh. Alright, so we're done with the Aston. Looks pretty good. I like the smoke. Watch out! It's clean. You can't go wrong with gunmetal on a black car. It's really one of those like safe setups that always just looks good. Spoke design is super open, so it's really sporty, which matches the Aston Martin language. Here's an idea of the offset in case you guys are curious. So it says pretty flush. All right guys, so we're done with the design on the door. So it looks really good. I like the geometric shape. And on the hood, we have the Griffin large and center. And on the back, we have follow me to the luxury up top and hashtag JW Houston downtown on the bottom. You guys are gonna see this car rolling around Houston, especially at nighttime. So let me know how it looks with the reflective decals. Let me know if it looks good. Ooh. So as you guys can see, there's a scuff on this Tesla Model S mirror and it's not looking too bueno. Normally we'd be a lot more worried for the client if this was actually a normal situation. However, this mirror has been clear bra, so we're gonna try to remove the clear bra right now and see how much of this damage actually went through the clear bra or if the film protected the paint after all. Normally something like this would have damaged the paint for sure, definitely would have scuffed it at the very least. Not sure if it would need to be repainted, but definitely paint corrected. Uh, let's see how it looks with the film off. Okay, so far so good. It's coming off with the film. Ooh, I think it's, I think it's taking away. Oh, nice. There's nothing on the mirror. The film took all the damage. We're done with the five layers of ceramic coating on this Audi, so let me show you what it looks like while we're outside. Look at this paint. It is freaking gloss. You can see the metallic flakes just popping. We've also clear brought the entire car as well, so anywhere that's blue has been clear brought. Even the mirrors here. We're now gonna do the water bean test. Test number one of a cut action. Get, get to my hand. You ready? Get, get to my hand. Uh, yep, yep, get yep, to my hand. Yep, got it. Get to my, yep. Whoa. It is on my shoes now. So that's what we're looking for, guys. Perfect little the circular. The properly. The water beads into little beads. No spreading. It will run in channel. 
Oh, my shoe got too wet again. Bean wire sliding down just like that. And that's perfect. That's exactly what we're looking for. Look at that. Perfect little wire droplet just like that. That way we know it's hydrophobic. So imagine having a ceramic coating on your car and you're going 60, 70 miles an hour and it's raining. Imagine how much of the water will sheet off once you're done. So this is why your car can stay cleaner a lot longer and a lot easier. That's it for the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. We want to work on your car, so hit us up. Our contact info is in the description down below. Click up here for a video recommend just for you. Down here for a newest video and up here to subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. So it's all faded, right? He used a torch and just burned his plastic and it brought the color back. I kind of want to try. Hello. Bro, it's making it worse. It's whiter than ever now.